All right, how's everyone doing? This is a beta demo of Enigmatis 2. This is the second game in the series. The first one came out in 2011. It's uh, actually a long time ago, two years ago. This one's called Miss of Ravenwood. And I've already got myself my detective name set in here. And I just want to tweak this out at the bottom of here. So yeah, so here we go. Let's not waste any time in it. In the menu here, let's get right into the game. Uh, yes, of course, but it's a casual. A whole year has passed since the events of Maple Creek. And I'm still on the hunt for the evil preacher. So far, the murderers stayed one step ahead. But I have a lead. There are rumors of people disappearing mysteriously on the West Coast. The situation sounds familiar, but could it just be a coincidence? What was that? What happened to the camper? Whoa! What on earth happened here? There's no evidence of a car crash, but that camper trailer is clearly damaged. What? How? I've never seen marks quite like that. It does definitely look like scratches, doesn't it? Alright, we're gonna get some interactive help here. The curse will change to a magnifying glass when you can examine the area in detail. The hankers are indicates you can interact with the object and pick up items. What was that anyways? Flare. First aid kit is locked, you need to open it. Cool. Alright, so I never played the first uh, en Enigmatis game. Uh, it was on my list, I do actually own it, and it is actually installed, but uh, never got around to playing it, just things kind of happened, and I am a huge fan of Artifacts Mondays games, so... Let me know what maybe I will play the first game. I don't know. I guess it depends on how well I like the demo of this one, if that makes any sense whatsoever. Well, it has a lot to do with the fact that I like to play games in order, because I mean, clearly this one's a sequel. Alright, let's find out what's going on here. Picture! Becky, my little butterfly. Who is this girl? Did something happen to her? I don't know. Crucial evidence to your investigation is stored. For further deductions, click the evidence sheet to view. Oh, this is different. You can have a closer look at each piece of evidence. Hmm. Am I supposed to like flick it around or something? Looks like this girl's name is Becky. Indeed. So that's definitely neat. We're like laying it out here on a canvas or something. Back. What else do we have in here? We have a frog. Ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> Rachel Simmons. Simmonsons. Camper must belong to her. Take the keys, though. You found an elusive object search for 30 throughout the game. Information about the one found store here. Uh, elusive objects. Huh, interesting. Okay. Basically, another name for morphing objects. Let me get in here. What's with the creepy eyes? Alright, let's go back to the camper. Alright, we have keys. You can use an item. Oh, actually, let's lock the inventory. No, I guess it can't. Not while we're in mode of tutorial here. Smash that up there. Charlie and his angels. Oh, that's adorable. Looks like we're missing a key here. Ooh, how do I get there? Oh, I reach that with my hand. I do not do it that way. Alrighty then. So we're gonna actually just lock the inventory bar. Thank you very much, developers, for that. The alarm clock reads quarter to nine. This has been a very ominous start to my day. Oh, I think I found the girl. <laughs> Oh, she's adorable. The curse will change to a mouth icon when you can speak to the character. You're not my mom. Where is she? It's okay, sweetheart. I won't hurt you. Let's get you out of there. Come on. You don't have to be afraid anymore. I'm here to help. Can you tell me what happened? My mom. 
She's gone. I'm scared. Is your name Becky? Becky, you're safe with me now. Take a deep breath and try to tell me again. Where's my mom? I want to talk to my mom. She's too shook up to talk to me. I need to calm her and win her trust somehow. Maybe if I could fix her a little scratch there. Hey, you want a flare? They're cool. All the cool kids want flares. No flare for you? Alright, fine. The girl. That's my objective, is it? Alright, what do we have here? We got some drawn here. Butterfly plus butterfly equals heart. Uh -huh. We're on a fishing uh, expedition, are we? Okay. Some butterfly shaped item goes here. Indeed. This poor coffee. Oh, what a sad day for this poor coffee. That is a sad day. Alright, let's see if we can fish this out here with our toy fishing rod. Look at us go here. Right, let's go get her some medical aid. What was that? Ghost. I saw it earlier on the drive in. Indeed, we did see it. Alright, let's go ahead and get some first aid here. Got some hydrogen peroxide and little bandages. And let's go ahead and do the hidden object scene. Oh, look at this. Find and use the objects. It's a skunk? Oh, it's a badger. <laughs> slinky. Oh, I thought I, I wanted it to be the slinky. Uh, what do we have to do here? I need a tool to remove it. I have that tool. Let a screw. I need a screw. Okay, we can probably get a screw here. This little plasticky screw. Wax a. Uh, I like how it's pink here. It's cool. Now I have a mouse. I have a wind up toy. Or wind up key. Go, go, go. Oh. Hey, Badger, want this? Here you go, fella. Actually, I don't know if it's a fella. It could be a girl. Dryer. Hmm. I should cut. I should cut on the shrub without damaging the sweater. Okay. A key. Padlock key. I kind of like this, uh, fully interactive scene here, by the way. This is actually quite adorable. This poor teddy bear is missing its leg. Do oh. you want another wing? Yes. Put its sweater on and fix the butterfly beret. Wow. That is incredibly. Look, we can maybe. Yep, there we go. Snip all that off there. Probably have to dry it too. It's all furry now and fuzzy. Get his leg. I think we need his uh, yarn or thread or whatever. Maybe we do this. Excellent. We'll do the repair for you. Oh, we have the teddy bear, which is totally going to be winning her heart. Here, have some of this. No, maybe we should give her this for Teddy! She was a present from my mom. Oh, yes, your mom. That should only sting a little. Eek. Now let's put a bandage on that scratch and make it all better. I'd like to know where she got the scratch from. My mom and dad are gone. A monster took them. Can you find them? Please? A monster? Fast. Oh, sweetheart. There's no such thing as monsters. There is the monster. Good grief. No, I'm pretty sure that qualifies as a monster. Get her hand, get her hand, a quick time event. Wow, look at all that glass. It's all gone. The camper, my truck, 
Becky, where are they? And all the other stuff, too. What is going on here? Please tell me I'm hallucinating. Um, I don't know what you're doing. Alright, let's just... Something feels... I don't know if that cutscene was based on music or not. But... Oh, I want to see I really hope the sunlight was playing tricks on my eyes. No, I'm pretty sure it wasn't. Oh yeah, we lost some time. Alarm clock from the camper, wait. Only 20 minutes has passed? Why is it so bright all of a sudden? Good question. It's never wise to approach a wild animal. Okay. Well, it looks like we have to go forward. Who's this guy? Guys. Uh, this is Ravenwood Park or something? Park plan, the Trident Titan. There's much to see in the park, and it seems a giant tree is just the highlight. Well, should we talk to these fellows here? Welcome to Ravenwood Park, ma'am. I'm Gerald Whitmarsh, the owner. Hmm, a missing family, a stolen camper, a monstrous creature outside my park. Okay, okay, please calm down, ma'am. I'll be happy to help you. Though I'm sorry to say we didn't see anything. We only opened a few minutes ago. Hmm, seems I left my cell phone in my mansion on the other side of the valley. I'll go call for help. In the meantime, why don't you relax and tour the park a bit? Take a ride on the Redwood Gondola, free of charge. You can get a ticket here at the shop. Oh, and we just had new maps printed. Here, take one. They look great, don't they? In any case, you can find me in my residence on the other side of the valley. What kind of guy leaves a cell phone? Oh, this is adorable. Man. Cool. Okay, what else we got going on here? Who's this guy? I'm off to go call for help in just a moment. Alright, let's talk to the uh, girl in here. Lady, I should say. Titan Tree, the second largest living redwood in the world. Yeah, it does. Welcome to the park, ma'am. I overheard you speaking to Mr. Whitmarsh. What a frightening story. I'm sorry to say, I didn't witness a thing. Here's that Redwood Gondola ticket. You might as well enjoy the view. It'll be some time before help arrives. Should you need anything at all, don't hesitate to ask the park staff. That's not encouraging at all to know that help is like a long way away. Please enjoy your stay at the park while you wait for help to arrive. Alrighty then, so what are we looking for? Let's get out of here. Oh, they're running off there, of course they are. Did it just... something just... Flare! Hmm. I wonder what the symbol means, I don't know. Looks like he's missing an eye. Let's... The far gone the Fangar, the father of the forest. Well, oh, found another one, I didn't do that. Don't hurt myself. Stack bar! Closed for renovations. Oh. That is a shame. Hey! It's her butterfly thing! The butterfly pendant! Becky was wearing it around her neck! Hi, Mom! Dun, dun, dun. She's gone! What's it doing under the snack bar door? Is Becky in there? But they all claimed not to have seen a thing. Something's fishy in here. Let's see a key there. Before I get the key out. Alright, let's mosey on back here. It's a woodpecker! He just slams his door, does he? I'll take that glass cutter. The guy will see. Good morning, ma'am. When the museum opens in a few minutes, you can go up and ride the gondola. You can see he's actually moving already, buddy. Looks like a fresh supply of souvenirs. Alright, well, glass cutter indeed. 
we open it with the glass, maybe? Yep. Don't mind me. Go Strange. How come it was locked from the inside if there's no other exit? Indeed. Is that my trapdoor token? Hmm. Roll crossbow without a bow string. Who's this fella here? Was someone watching me through the window, or did I imagine that? No, it was definitely somebody there. And now I have the complete willies. Here you go. Ah, uh, drag the pins in the corners of slots along the tracks to the top slot to fold the bird's wing. Uh, okay. Like this? This way. Oh, I think I. Huh. How do I get this one to move? Wow, this is actually kind of weird. Uh. So what we really need to do is get this moving. Here we go. We did it! I think. That one's done. That one's done. Oh, let's go down to the dark, spooky basement. Well, we are a private detective. Oh my god, what the hell was that? <laughs> who did that? Holy crap! Oh, who was that? And what is this place? I don't At know. least I'm not hurt. I'm surprised. Looks like I'll need the bottom half of this ladder. Are you then? How am I supposed to get over here? Oh, flared up. Yeah, there we go. Well, this is a little more creepy than I was expecting. What's in here? I need something to break open this crate. We do it. The door pulley is broken. I need to find a way to lock it. In. The pulley is damaged and won't lock into place. I'll have to find a way to lock it while the door is open. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll work on that. Go ask me a question. <laughs> Fuel lamp is bone dry. I'm not comfortable in the dark. I need more light. Out. I need your help, and if you're down here, then you're in need of mine. We can't trust anyone out there. This place is not what it seems. I'm supposed to... Who are you? Why are you locked up down here? I came here to settle an old score. My friend came out on top, for the time being. You're here to find some missing people, aren't you? But like me, you found yourself in trouble instead. I will help you get out of here and assist you in your investigation. But in return, I need you to release me. Trust me, we share the same foe. I don't trust you. How can we help each other? I know a bit about our enemy and this place. I will give you clues and tell you his story. I'll also give you a few small artifacts I managed to steal from him and keep hidden in my cell. In return, you'll release me. As you can see, my cell has quite a complex lock. The relief is the key. If I know my enemy, its pieces are scattered around the park, in the tunnels, trees, everywhere. Should you manage that, my assistance will turn from words to actions. Okay, I guess we have to trust him. 
Why not, right? Alright, so we still don't need we still need oil though. Uh, let's go and chop this up here. Assuming that's okay. Kerosene will burn just nicely. Let's go ahead and turn here. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Light it up. Ooh, that's a creepy looking ladder. I guess that's it, right? This thing just keeps crawling away on me. Can we shove the this thing? In? No. Hmm. All right, fine, fine, fine. The pulley is damaged and won't lock into place. I'll have to find a way to lock it while the door is open. What's this all about? The bottom of the trap door has a strange mechanism. It's missing two pieces. Uh, no axe for you. What's this? Charcoal? The pulley is damaged and won't lock into place. I'll have to find a way to lock it while the door is open. Okay. Oh, where's my map? Oh, it just shows me that I'm down here. Uh, I guess we're supposed to put it here? It must be the code of some sort, but I can't decipher the ruins. I need a piece of paper, I'm guessing. I need this instead? No. Only those who follow the master may pass. I'm not sure what we're doing here. There's gotta be something else that we're missing in this area. Well, he's useless. Oh. What's all this? I'll take you, though. If you pin your evidence on this board, I can help you in your investigation. I can see the whole board from here. Just clear the remaining stuff off it. Alright. Because I like a crowbar. Perfect. What exactly are you investigating? I have evidence that a few people disappeared this morning at the park gate, under highly unusual circumstances. It comes as no surprise to me. I'll help you find them. Start off by identifying our missing persons. Alright. From now on, your evidence will be stored in this wall. You will also assist with evidence to draw conclusions. Excellent. You need two more pieces of evidence to complete the case subject circle. We have them. Yep. We, we know who. We're the at. whole family is gone. The mother's purse was left next to the park gate, together with her wallet, car keys, documents, and a picture of her daughter. The very girl I found. My mom, mom and dad, dad are gone. gone. A monster took them. Can, Can you find them? them? Please. And then lost, moments later. Such a happy family. Indeed. I can't leave now. I have to find them. But first, we need to establish what happened to them after they were taken. And who's behind their disappearance. But I can't do my part until I get out of this dungeon. Obviously. I think I can help you. Come here to the cell door. I love the child. When the prisoner reflection is visible in the saw blade, then the information will tell you. Your way in is your way out. The trap door. Among my few possessions, I have one of the two keys. To find the second, you'll have to search the maze of tunnels beyond the metal door. Decipher the rune symbols above the door. 
They will lead you through the maze. Good luck. All right, thank you. Decipher the rune symbols above the door. They will lead you through the maze. A piece of paper, a sheet. All right. Let's go. We can now go up here and do some charcoal activity. This one here. Oh, we actually have to do it. Awesome. Uh, I don't know what that means, but we shall take it. Uh, I don't know if a claw here it is. All right, well that's one done. Threaded hook, crowbar. Not sure which one's actually gonna work. Such a lock. Crowbar? Or crowbar. Yep. Excellent. The maze the prisoner spoke of. I should follow the runes in the code he gave me. Okay. Creepy. Someone was buried here alive. <laughs> that is way too creepy. All right, we're going this way. Need more runes. There's a symbol under the moss. Scrape it off, then. Uh, runes might be the key. What am I supposed to do? Well, I mean, if it's that's that way, it's gotta be this way. Uh, it's gotta be this way. Let's go. Okay, so that's that way. It's got to be this way. We can scrape it off just to double check. Yep, X it is. Alright, so it's gonna be this way. It seems I've reached some kind of chamber. Indeed. Alright, what do we get? Talic relief. Oh, that's for his thing. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. Oh, it's a fragmented uh, hidden object scene here. I'm not exactly sure what we're doing here. this for? I don't know, we're gonna keep on clicking here until we get everything that we need to get. The rock is cracked, anything hard would break it. Yeah, smash it good. So what do we have? We have a couple more things left here. Uh, looks like we're just making some sort of uh, handcuffs here. We have here doors locked with a riddle. It looks like two blocks are missing. I think I only have one. No, I have zero. Unless it's pulling while the chain is broken. to go down the creepy dungeon area here. I do. There's the other foot. <sighs> what is this place? Oh my god, this is insane. There's bodies everywhere. Dozens of corpses. 
This is bad, everybody. We got some more evidence. Good grief. Alright, we're gonna get out of here. Alright, up we go. Whoa, super bright. What on earth was that? I don't know, it was very unnerving. What is that strange light phenomenon? It's not the first time I've seen it. Yeah, it's the monster. It was that fog raven thing that attacked the camper trailer. And the park, it looks deserted? Different, I would say, for sure. All right, folks, well, this is where we're going to end the game here, or the beta. Let me know what you think about it. Definitely finding it creepy, enjoying the detective nature of this. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Maybe I play this game when it comes out. I don't know, maybe I should play the first game. I don't know. Let me know what you think. I'm your Gibbs, and we'll see you next time.